Hey guys, welcome back to Tony's How To. In this video, I'll be showing you how to remove Steam Mobile Authenticator without a phone. Before we start, hurry up and check out these offers just on this video. So let's get started. So the first thing that you want to do here is you want to open up the Steam app and click on the Help I Can't Sign In button that I see at the bottom left here. Now the next page, what we need to do is you want to go and choose the option here that says I deleted or lost my Steam Guard Mobile Authenticator. Let's go and press on it. Now it's going to basically ask you to enter the email address that you've set for your account. So enter the email address and confirm that you are human and click on search and that will search for your account. Now you want to go and just choose the uh, uh, option here. As long as you have or still have access to your email, email account, you just need to choose the email and account verification code on the following email address. Let's go and choose that one. Now it's going to say an account verification link was sent to your email address. So go and open up your email. Open up the link from Steam support and let's go ahead and open the link that we just saw in here. And what you just need to do is you want to go and just click on resume recovery and this should open up a new tab. Now in here, what we need to do is you want to go and just choose the uh, following options. So we have the reset my password, uh, reset my email address, I need help with a different code. But if you are having issues with your authentication, like if you've set an authenticator in your account, you go and just click on the remove authenticator from my account here and just follow the on-screen steps in order for you to remove that authenticator in order for you to log in into your account. Now, obviously, they may require you to change your password as well and uh, enter some recovery uh, code that they'll be sending you. But once you're done with that, you should be good. And that's about it. So if you found this video helpful, hit the like and subscribe button and watch our next video.